The sky's the limit for 16-year-old Ariane. Only a month ago she completed her first solo flight, giving her a bird's eye view of our glorious Solon scenery. I was a bit nervous, but um, I adapted quickly and I felt very comfortable in it. I loved it. So you felt sort of free as well because you're above everyone else. The view, really, it was, um, I never really seen where I lived from the air before, so it was, it was really nice to see everything in sort of perspective and stuff like that. Ariane's talent was discovered when she was doing work experience at a flight school. Yes, we liked to take them for a short flight and I took Ariane up and asked her to take the controls of the aeroplane and straight away I could see that she had a natural aptitude for flying. And so that was our first experience together. And Ariane was in the passenger seat, sat next to me, but they're dual control aircraft because they're used for training. So I just asked her to take the controls and she seemed very comfortable doing it and I asked her to turn left and turn right and, and she was just natural, she could feel the aeroplane moving with us. So uh, I did, we decided shortly after that that we ought to teach her to fly. Well I'd never been in a plane before then so, and I'd always wanted to so I thought I might as well come here and see what it's like. So I decided to come here and I was here for two weeks doing work um, so in the office and plane maintenance. And, yeah. Being as skilled as Ariane at such a young age is a rare thing. But it's also unusual to find a teenage girl in the captain's seat. Usually the boys that come to us have um, been learning to fly on flight simulators and, and they, they'll, they'll uh, use the controls in, in, in a flight simulator way. In, in other words, they'll fly the aeroplane all over the sky. But uh, Ariane didn't do that. She was able to control it very carefully and keep it within the limits of the aeroplane because she had no flight simulator experience. Um, so uh, it, it is quite rare to find someone with that skill at that age. Ariane's future looks bright. The flight school will sponsor her to complete a full European private pilot's license, which will help her pursue a professional flying career. I'd like to go to university and um, uh, get a degree in either French and another language, maybe French or Russian maybe, and then just pursue a career in flying really, after that. We would like to see her take up a career in flying. She has a natural aptitude for flying and that talent ought to be honed uh, right the way through to commercial pilot's license. Nicole Ries for That Solent.